All right, so I'm here with my man Freddie, and we're rehabbing his shoulder. Freddie's a big dude; he works out a lot, right, bud? Yep. Right, and uh, and basically when he came in, he said, you know, his right shoulder's rolling forward more. This is actually really, really common with guys. You probably heard other guys say the same thing, mm -hmm. right? Shoulders rolling forward. So we've been doing some muscle testing to figure out what muscles are firing. Then we do the rehab, and then we align that spine because you've got to get that brain to body connection. So we're gonna do this. Watch how we reposition him gently. We're gonna just, yeah, and then no, you, you bring both arms up. And then we're gonna just gently bring him down a little bit. There we go, exactly. And then feet flat on the floor. Okay, and sit up tall, push up here, push, push, push. So you can see, if you kind of zoom in on this area right here, um, right here, go ahead and straighten your arm out. Push up, push, push, push. What you can see is that his anterior deltoid's not firing and his shoulder's moving back into the socket. He's using his really big, strong back muscles. So I'm gonna just protrude him a little bit more like that. Now push up, and then it just goes weak. And so. You know, many times people like Freddie, they go and they get adjusted, but if we don't dig in and get those muscles firing in addition to getting them aligned, I mean, you know the answer. Straighten that out, bud. Push up, push. You see it already, so drop your arm here. It's the best part. Yeah. <laughs> this is the best part, man. Come on. Breathe nice and deep. Now, I've had this done. It doesn't feel good. It gets the job done. I'm gonna get his anterior deltoid firing again properly. Breathe through it. Ah, oh, man, it feels so good. Yeah, <laughs> I love it. He's a smart man, using the psychology. Using oh. Breathing deep, hold your breath. Don't help me, don't help, don't help. Death weight, right? I'm gonna go ahead and counter strain his subclavius and his upper trap. Breathe in, relax, sir. Excellent, shoulders relaxed. Okay, then what we're gonna do is have him on his back. Okay. We're going to align that upper thoracic, upper back area. Breathe in, all the way out. These nerves go to the shoulder. Drop it again. Okay, we got a little bit of movement there. It wasn't a huge release. And then what we're gonna do is adjust his occiput, the upper neck here. Breathe in deep, Freddy. And out. Excellent. Ooh. Good. That was a big one. That was a good one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And we're going to go ahead and lay face down now, sir. Oh. And then we're going to breathe in. <sighs> big motion there, sir. Now we're going to have you lay on your left side, then. Good man. Everything's going smoothly today. Freddie, yes, you know, sir. Try to, try to get dialed in here. Hips relaxed. Drop the tummy like that. Okay. Same thing, lower back's a little tight like his upper back. We're gonna come on over this way. You know, sometimes we don't get a big release with an adjustment, but as long as we're getting the correct motion, the joints moving and stimulating the brain, we just persist. That's why we're on a care plan, right, my man? Yep. Come on. Big breath in and out. Hips relax, go ahead, head back a little bit, right there. Excellent. The man is dialed in. Come That's on up. That's the one. That's the one right there. And then last uh, chest up for me. Last one. Hands out front again. Okay, you can drop the left one now. Push, push. Lock your elbow really good. Lock. Solid. All right, my man. Thank you. Legend. 